Hello. In this video, I will demonstrate how to open MATLAB through MySCC. This video is only useful for Scottsdale Community College students because those are the ones who have access to this resource. I recommend pausing the video frequently as you follow the steps on your own computer. Open an internet browser, preferably Google Chrome. Navigate to scottsdalecc.edu, then click on the Students tab. Scroll down and look on the right side. Click on My SCC. Then log in with your MEID and password. Once logged in, you'll see a screen like this. All of these software options are available for you for free as an SCC student. Our focus is on MATLAB. To find it, open the Math folder, then select MATLAB. When prompted, click Open Citrix Workspace Launcher. It will then take a minute or so for MATLAB to boot up. Now, if this is the first time you are using Citrix on your own computer, you likely won't see the Open Citrix box. Instead, you will be prompted to download the Citrix receiver. Download it, install it, and then return to these steps. Eventually, you should see a screen similar to what is shown here. The very first step you should do anytime you open MATLAB is to connect to your special folder where you'll be saving your work. I recommend doing this on a flash drive. If you try saving it to your desktop for MATLAB, that actually saves it to your virtual network desktop and not to your computer's local files. Using a flash drive saves a lot of difficulties. So first, outside of MATLAB, I will open my flash drive and create a folder that I will use to save my MATLAB work. I will call it MATLAB underscore 105. You can name yours whatever you want, but use no spaces in the folder name. Then in MATLAB, let's connect to that folder. To do this, click on the icon near the top left with a green arrow coming out of a folder. After clicking, you will see a prompt requesting access. Select the Read and Write option. Now, navigate to your flash drive and then to the folder you just made. Click on the folder and then click on the Select Folder button. Since there are no files in that folder yet, this current folder window is going to be empty. This will change soon as we write and save code. And that is all. This is our gateway to learning MATLAB.